530 with crime among young people skyrocketing, a local lawmaker pushing to expand a youth detention center in Louisville. From carjackings to shootings and homicides, crimes involving juveniles are rising at an alarming rate, according to LMPD. And WLKY's Lauren Adams was in Frankfurt as a state lawmaker from Louisville met with colleagues urging funding for a bigger youth detention center. We really need a solution and some changes. Republican state lawmaker Kevin Bratcher spent Thursday in Frankfurt on a mission. I have a, a constituent in my district that was carjacked, and she says she will not go out at night anymore. And what kind of price tag do you put on that? That is just horrible. In this case, $6.5 million. That's how much he says it will cost to transform the Jefferson County Youth Detention Center to a 40-bed facility. That price tag also includes having the Department of Juvenile Justice operate it and launch a one-year pilot program to provide outpatient therapy. Not having a detention center is not helping us. It's getting worse. LMPD Lieutenant Dale Thompson says a growing number of kids under 18 are being tied to shootings and carjackings across the metro. This is a daily occurrence. It's like Grand Theft Auto in the city of Louisville, and it's a video game and these, there's no accountability for these kids. He says it's a constant game of catch and release because there are few options. A transitional center, essentially a holding place downtown, a few beds at that youth detention center on LaGrange Road, and in some cases, youth are being sent to a center in Adair County. Now, during the last legislative session, Representative Bratcher filed similar legislation. House Bill 318 would have guaranteed that all offending juveniles stay off the streets until seeing a judge. That easily cleared the House, but never made it to the Senate. This time around, he says failure isn't an option. It's why he's asking for that money to expand the youth detention center. Members of the Judicial Oversight Committee want more juvenile services to be included in the bill, which Bratcher agrees is a must. We have got to get in front of the, the kid or we can't help the kid. They're being released too soon. So that is just a problem and we've got to fix it. In Frankfurt, Lauren Adams, WLKY News. Thank you, Lauren. And that bill is still in draft form, but Bratcher says it will be ready for the 2023 legislative session.